Brazil has the largest universal health system in the world, and we have a lot of data. That huge amount of data is not used to make decisions, is not used to provide services in a smart way. So it's a hotspot for AI use because you can use different sources of data and create new solutions in order to integrate this data. And we were facing a situation where a lot of government bodies from the federal, state, municipal level, all of them were interested to acquire AI solutions, but they didn't know how to procure these kind of things. And so we decided to make a project about that. We developed a framework to support the Brazilian public sector in order to acquire AI in a responsible and most effective way. One of the uses that we are doing is about hospital exams. The AI project was used to screen COVID problems in the lung of the patients at the beginning of the pandemic. We first involved more than 50 hospitals in Brazil in order to understand what kind of solution we would have to develop. Because it's not like to procure software from Microsoft that's available for everybody. That's a final product. No, each AI product is specific for application according to needs. It's not packaged in a box. And after we did that, the next step was to make the acquisition. And this is the AI procurement in a box that we developed. The C4IR network had a huge impact in our project. The collaboration was key because we didn't start from zero. We had some work that were developed in the UK. We accessed this knowledge and experience of the people of the network who participated in this initiative. We've adapted the material for the Brazilian reality and applied it then in a real world situation. It saved us time, money, and most important, we used the project in the UK to convince actors in Brazil to do that. This project will help them to make the right decisions, to make the right acquisitions, have the right impact.